Now pay close attention, children. An electrical charge flows through a section of conductor. The current's intensity is expressed in amperes. The source of the tension, however, is measured in volts. This is what gives it the energy it needs to maintain the current. If the tension given out from the source is constant, a continuous current flows. This there isn't one ticket left, completely sold out, and I absolutely have to find one by tonight. Relax, Odd. Aylita's gonna give us each a ticket. She's the opening act at the concert, and she's got comps for all of us. I know that. The problem is I need two tickets for tonight. Ah, so you made a girl a promise you didn't know if you could keep? You could never understand, Uri. Ah, hmm? would you repeat what I just said? What exactly is an electrical charge? Uh, it's the, the amount you have to pay every month for electricity. <laughs> <laughs> Not exactly an enlightening answer. I know someone else who's a lot more stressed out about tonight. Hmm? Yeah! Oh. Yeah, I was good. Oh, I don't know. Oh. Aren't you coming to lunch, Jeremy? No, I came up with a brand new program that should help us to locate new replicas. I have just one or two more calculations to work out. See you later. I'll see you later, too. I've got a, an important errand to run. Hmm. Hey, Matthias, you wouldn't have a ticket left for tonight's concert, would you? Yeah, no problem. You mean it? This is the last one, and it's all yours. You're gonna love these guys. Aerosmooth. They're an incredible group. Uh, Aerosmooth? Hmm. Sub digitals. I like them better as the subsonics. I like their new name. Well, Ailita, all set for the big night? Don't even talk about it. I'm so scared. Welcome to stardom. Listen to this. In our next issue, an exclusive interview with Ailita Stones, Caddick's brightest new star. Did you know about this? Millie and Timmy haven't stopped hassling me for over a week for that interview. But I didn't promise them anything. Oh, you know what those two are like, always looking for a little gossip. Forget about that stuff, think about the concert. Whenever I do, I get major butterflies in my stomach. I wish I could stop thinking about it. Hmm. If I could just get my mind off it for a little while. I'll go and see if Jeremy needs any help with his calculations. See you later. I don't believe this, I'm jinxed. The last ticket slipped right under my nose just now. But Alita's got a free ticket for you. Yeah, but that's not enough for Odd's little harem. Laugh at me, go on, but where do you see Kelly? Then you'll know why I've got to make this first date absolutely perfect. You mean to say this is the first time you're going out together? Well, let's not get into all the details. It's a shame I can't count on a little help from my friends. Try my brother. The little weasel must have some sort of connection. Hiroki! You're right, I hadn't thought of him. Yumi, you're a genius! Eric, you really ought to go out with her. Uh... Hey! Uh, you and I are just good friends, isn't that right? Right. Hello, we're looking for Aylita. We're supposed to interview her. Do you know where we can find her? She went, went to the, the gym. gym. Okay. Thanks a lot. Just doing our share to support school journalism. <laughs> Aylita, we've been looking all over for you. Yeah, we have. Would you give us your autograph, please, Aylita? Um, uh... Ow! You dart! Mm. Can't you see that she's just dying to? But I'm on to you. Mrs. Einstein thinks she's a big star now that she's a cover girl for a magazine. I didn't know anything about... Everyone knows that I should have been picked to play the opening act of the concert, and you're bound to make a total fool of yourself tonight. Huh. Can't wait to see that. And you will, Sissy. In fact, you're going to have plenty of time to watch from the audience, because it's Aylita who's going to be on stage and not you. Am I disturbing you, Jeremy? I just finished running my initial calculations. Thanks to my program, we'll be able to find the last replicas with no problem. Oh, that's great. Um, uh, say, Jeremy, about tonight. Oh, right, the concert. I bet you can't wait to get on stage. Um, not really. 
When I'm alone at my mixing table, I'm fine. But in such a huge auditorium... You'll be great, Ailita. Don't worry about it. What's more, Yumi, Ulrich, and Odd will be cheering you on. Huh? And what about you? Uh, I gotta wait until the calculations finish running, and then I've got a couple of things to do, and uh, so I might be a little late. But I promise to come as soon as I'm done. Oh, what? As soon as you're done? I'm dying of stage fright, and all you can say is that you're going to be late to my concert? No, um, that isn't exactly what I meant. I meant to say that if it's really that important to you, well then... Important? I'm standing here telling you I may not be able to do it. Isn't that important enough for you? Here's your invitation. You can always give it to someone else if you don't find the time to come. Haruki, you've got to be kidding! Take it or leave it, Odd. I can get double the price I'm asking you from at least a dozen other kids. Um, uh, you wouldn't take an IOU from your sister's best friend, would you? Mm -mm. See ya. And if I catch you groveling again in front of that stuck-up pink-haired mouse, I'm taking back those comps. You know what the mouse thinks of you? Uh, what? Huh. You wouldn't have a bunch of comps for tonight, huh? Huh, what do you think? Being the principal's daughter has its advantages. And, um, you wouldn't have an extra one by any chance? Hmm? I do, but not for you, Odd. <laughs> 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 then again, if you could convince Ulrich to go to the concert with me and not with that skinny crow, well, what do you think? Hmm? Hmm. Okay. Hmm. <clears throat> Ta-da! <laughs> How was your hunting expedition? Odd the Great wanted a ticket, Odd the Great got a ticket. And Odd didn't pay an arm and a leg for it? Uh, no, no, no. Oh, oh, and by the way, Ulrich, I want to ask you a teeny-weeny favor, okay? That's me a favor? Come on, what kind of favor? Mm hmm? Oh, no big rush. Why don't we talk about it later? <laughs> there you are. I came to give you your tickets for tonight. What's wrong? No, it's nothing. It's, it's on account of Jeremy. Einstein wins another first prize in diplomacy? Yeah, I guess you might say that. Oh, relax, princess. You'll see you're gonna bring the house down tonight. For sure. Yeah! Anyway, don't get there too late. The crowd's gonna be really big. <laughs> huh? Surprise! <laughs> we came to see our favorite star before she gets too famous to see us. Don't be so silly. I'm really glad to see you all. Um, didn't Jeremy come? Sure he did, but we lost him in the crowd. You know Einstein, a great head for math, but it's always in the clouds everywhere else. Don't worry, he'll be out there listening and cheering you on. I hope so. Eilita, you're on in five minutes. Time for me to start concentrating. Okay then, we'll take off. You look beautiful tonight. You're gonna knock him out. <laughs> oh my god, you're the one you I'm friends. You said you not even hurt. Kelly, this is Yumi and Ulrich. Hi. Hello. Oh, hi. Let's go. Odd! Oh, hey, sissy. How are you doing? What's that skinny crow doing here? Mm -hmm. I gave you a ticket in exchange for a date with Ulrich. What? Well, uh... In that case, give me back my ticket. Huh? Uh, Kelly, you can have mine. Listen, Odd, you told me you spent your last penny buying tickets to this concert. Not that you were wheeling, dealing with Dalmas. Loser. You can keep your ticket. I wonder if she bites. By the way, Odd, what was that teeny-weeny favor you wanted me to do? Forget it. Aelita, can we ask you a couple of questions for the Catholic News? Not now. You couldn't have picked a worse time. Aelita, you're on in just two minutes. I'm afraid you'll have to leave now, girls. how late it was. Just one more calculation to run. I'll be right there. Not now. It's Alita's turn now. Sophie, 
I'm ready. So am I. Hello? Chris? Eileen not at all well. She can't do the first part of the concert. You'll have to begin without her. Hmm. Eileen is sick, guys. We're going on cold without an opening act. That's a real bummer. I sure hope it's not serious. Anyway, let's go get him. Hmm. Ladies and gentlemen, the Sub Digitals! Xana's just launched an attack. They just canceled Ailita's opening act. That sounds like Xana. Check it out and then meet me at the factory. Xana alert. Let's go backstage and see if Ailita's okay. Always a celebration. There she is, over there. It's time to play. We can tell you Uh, you think maybe they're angry because they blew a scoop? <sighs> I'll try to distract them. You guys go and get Aelita back. Good luck dealing with the press. <laughs> Jeremy, a woman's taking Aelita away. She's probably heading for the factory. Okay, I'll try to head her off. You guys better hurry it up. Strategy. What's that in English? Let's go. <laughs> yes. How is that for strategy? <laughs> Guess we beat you here, Einstein. Where's Lilita? She already got virtualized on Lyoko. Nice 
people knew me? Thank you. Ready for the tall, dark, bad guy? Uh, I think we have an audience. <laughs> Jeremy, we're stuck here. No way to reach Aelita without some transport. Okay, Yumi, we'll have your vehicles in no time. Sorry, ladies, but no interviews. Okay. 
stage fright, but I guess it's because I've already been here, if you know what I mean. No way I was gonna miss the concert for the second time. You know, I, I didn't mean to blow up at you like that. I put too much pressure on myself. Maybe it was insane to want to do this concert. Alita, sometimes the sanest thing is to be insane. <laughs> and now, let's put them together for a brand new DJ, Alita Stone! Yeah! 